hello everyone and welcome back to my channel melanade beauty in today's video i'm going to be taking you on a journey with me of my normal day-to-day -day routine as a youtuber slash luxury picnic planner this was a highly requested video so i wanted to put together something for you guys to actually enjoy watching um so this is my very quick morning routine of when i have a picnic later in the day i do not put on makeup and yeah so then i get started with just checking some emails on my laptop and eating fresh fruit it's just a great way to start the morning and just sitting at my desk surrounded by plants to just make me feel at peace because i mean who wants to just get up and start working but that's what we have to do as entrepreneurs so After checking up on emails and taking notes of upcoming bookings I am going to start planning my current booking for tomorrow um, and I just you know plan out the picnic the night before or the day before depending on the size of the picnic so I'm completely prepared and I have you know you know missing items for when I arrive at my setup this is going to be just for four guests so it's not too crazy of prepping and I'm just using two wooden crates to fill up all of my charger plates and decor items do is now choose out some pillows for the picnic this is not even half of the madness that I have and yet I still have the urge to go buy inventory Hobby Lobby has been my current obsession lately, especially as a picnic planner. It is the perfect place to shop for inventory and they are always having deals, especially like 50 to 75% off. And this is where I now buy my charger plates, decor, and anything else that I could possibly use for my picnic business. So I popped in here, um, just to see if there were any last minute things that I could possibly use for the picnic. Don't get me wrong, Hobby Lobby is also really great for shopping for your own home decor as well. They have like several mirror sections, like multiple sections per category, if that makes sense. It's just so much stuff here. And the reason why I'm talking about this in this way is because my Hobby Lobby is um, a little over an hour away from me so I very rarely get to shop here so when I do make a trip I am just like a little girl in a candy shop every time. If you don't know by now my favorite place in any store is the clearance section and I found a few gems like these placemats these like rattan placemats with different um, color and pattern just for like a really colorful boho picnic in the future also found a jute rug and of course I found the famous giant connect four game that I've been searching for I scored that for only $23 and it was originally priced at $69. So a lot of you have been commenting and asking where I've purchased like pompous grass and stuff in my previous videos and here are very cheap bundles of pompous grass and dried florals that you can get here. They're 50% off 
and it comes with three stems in each pack and they're so gorgeous um, so I picked up a few of these as well definitely would suggest checking out the furniture section as well right now it's 30% off I love this farmhouse console table they also have a wide variety of pillows whether they're boho farmhouse or like luxury style like the velvet round pillows that's what I'm picking up for the picnics and they're 50% off and after I checked out from that store I popped into Ross and I found these wooden folding chairs for only eight dollars each and they are perfect for a setup that I have planned I don't know why but I always have the urge to pop into Target and check their dollar section because they just turn over the products so quickly and I feel like I'm always gonna miss something so just a few little reefs and blankets but nothing too spectacular So tomorrow is for a birthday party. So I'm buying some balloons just to add to the decor and make it more birthday-like. Um, and I'm also just checking out the new collection by Opal House. I love this tablecloth, perfect color for fall. Comment below if you are obsessed with these wooden rings like I am. The wood tone is a little bit too yellow for me, too warm, but I still really like these. I also would love a couple of these basket totes to hold like decorative flowers in as just decor. And honestly, I wouldn't mind working here just to organize this mess. It's kind of unacceptable, especially as a lover of home decor. <laughs> Okay, now that I'm back home after an exhausting day of shopping, I'm going to decorate this peacock chair for tomorrow's picnic. Um, just adding some dried florals and eucalyptus and pompous grass and palm leaves to make it very boho chic and touches of pinks because it is a girl's birthday. I love how this turned out. So it's the next morning and Daniel and I are all set and ready to go. We have all our supplies. So we're about to go and set up a picnic and I'll check in with you later.
And to pass the time by as the picnic is in session, Daniel and I like to grab a bite to eat and head to the park just to, you know, relax by the water. And now that I'm home, I'm so excited because my packages finally came. I have a future video coming up with Cricut and I'm gonna be making some awesome DIYs. So be sure to stay tuned for that. They sent me so much stuff that I just cannot wait to dig in and start crafting. Comment down below if you use Cricut before or comment any DIYs that you would probably like to see in the future because I'm gonna be using this thing a lot. And here's just a quick overview of everything that I purchased. I'm so pleased with everything that I was able to find and I will be going back to Hobby Lobby very soon. Thank you guys so much for watching to the end of this video. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this. And until next time, 